square root of 55 times 56 times 57 plus 1 equal to what? We want to solve this. I solve this with two solutions. The first solution is more specific and second solution is more general. I consider, for example, it is x, so solution number 1. If I raise both sides to the power of 2, then we can see left hand side will be 55 times 56 times 57 plus 1 equal to x squared. Now, in next step, I subtract 1 from both sides. So 55 times 56 times 57 equal to x squared minus 1. Now, in next step, we can see, and we can use this identity that a squared minus b squared equal to a minus b times a plus b. So, here it will be x minus 1, x plus 1. So, we can write it as product of two terms that their difference equal to 2. So, let's factorize 55 is 5 times 11 times 56 is 2 times 2 times 2, 8 times 9, uh, 8 times 7, and 57 is 3 times 19, equal to x minus 1 times x plus 1. Look, x minus 1 and x plus 1, both of them are odd, or both of them are even. If both of them be, because if the first one is odd, means x is even. If x is even, both of them are odd and it's contradiction because here we have 2 times 2 times 2, left hand side is even. So both parts should be even, okay? So because we have three twos, one part has one two and the other part has two twos, which is four. And what are the other factors uh, that are left? Three, let me write with other color. The other colors that are left are 3, 5, 7, let's write in increasing order, 11, 19, okay? And let me tell you something. These two numbers, we want to see x minus 1 is what, x plus 1 is what. These two numbers should be near to each other because the difference is 2. For example, if I say, okay, the first number, for example, one number, 2 times 3, the next number will be 4 times 5 times 7 times 11 times 19. This number is so small, this number is so much large. So we should select numbers that when you multiply by 2 and 4, they should be near to each other. Now, another thing that we should understand, if you want to consider all cases, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, each of them goes here or here for three we have two cases for five two cases so if you want to check all the cases two to the five thirty two you have thirty two cases to check but you don't need to check all of them because some of them for example if you place all of them here in this part and the other part in this part it won't it doesn't work because then the numbers should be near to each other so Let's check some cases. For example, if I select 3 times 7 here, 21, then 5 times 11 times 19 will be so much large. So let's check, for example, 3 times 5 times 7. Look, pause the video here and try to see, can you find an arrangement? So 3 times 5 times 7 will be what? 5 times 3, 21. 21 times 5 will be 5, 105. If you multiply these two numbers, 11 times 19 will be 19, 19, and 9, this 209. Okay. Now, uh, it is around twice this number, so I place 209 here and 105 here. If you multiply, this number will be 418, this number will be 420, and it's good because their difference is 2. Look, maybe in first. 
try you can't reach this number you should check and if you check some numbers that you see the difference you can find this order so we can say the first one is 418 and the next one is 420 so x is what x is 419 and the answer is 419 it was first solution now let me tell you second solution in second solution i want to multiply and i want to show you the algorithm for calculating a square root here square root of 55 times 56 times 57 plus 1 okay and i want to find this square root at first i multiply 55 by 56 5 times 6 30 and we have 3, 5 times 5, 25, plus 3, 28. 5 times again, you write the same number. And we add these two numbers, 8, this, 3, 30, 80. So this number will be 30, 80. Now we multiply this by 57 in next step. So let's do this. 57 times 308, 7 times 8, 56, we have 5, we place 5, 7 times 3, 21. 5 times 8, 40, we have 4, then we place 4, 5 times 3, 15. Then it will be 6, 5, 5, 7, 1. Okay, if we add by 1 this number, it will be 7, 5, 5, 7. Oh, sorry, here we had 0, so I should add 0, then plus 1, so it will be 6, 0, plus 1 will be this. Now I want to show you how to calculate square root of that. Finding a square root as an algorithm, important algorithm that is useful in many math exams. Let me solve this one. Square root of seven five five six one from right part you should consider digits two by two then what times itself is less than or equal 17 and is largest one four it will be 16 then you have one in next step you add the next two digits then you multiply this digit by two eight eighty what times what is good here eighty one times one it will be 81, it will be 4, it will be 7. Next step, you add the next two digits, 61. So it is 41, then you multiply 41 by 2, it will be 82. Now, I should see what number is good. If I place 1, it's not good. If I place 9, 9 times 9, 81, we have 8. 9 times 2, 18, plus 8, 26, we have 2. 9 times 8, 72, plus 2, 74. The algorithm is this, and then you take 9, here it's 490. If you want to learn the algorithm of square root, or learning important ideas, feel free to send a message to my WhatsApp number in the description and comments. And please don't forget to subscribe, turn on notification, and like the video. Thanks, have a good day, see you next time, bye.